Next 48 for the viewer spirit. We have the Five of Swords and the Strength card. Someone has a strong jealousy towards you. They have a strong, like, evil eye on you and towards you. And it's like, this could have been a person that sabotaged you in the past or something like that. You could be a Leo or a Leo significant. Um, you could also be an air sign, Gemini, Leo, Aquarius. Somebody has a strong evil eye towards you. They're very, very jealous about something. Like, your power and also your ability to, like... I don't know. You could have a very strong shadow. And I'm low-key... I heard, like, <laughs> low-key like show me your strength so somebody wants to provoke you um because they want to see your shadow they want they want to see it come out somebody could have brought your shadow up they could have brought out the, your fucking tiger your lion they could have brought it out they could have brought it the fuck out you could have gave them what they were looking for dead ass but it's something about your resilience and willpower. Even when you're in that energy, you stand in that. You know who you are and you understand your emotions. You respect your emotions. Um, you understood somebody here had something out for you. With this nine of cups coming out, it's like that's what someone wishes for to like rile you up or something like to get a reaction out of you someone could be looking for a reaction out of you all right but um i feel like some of you guys you could be learning how to alchemize your energy or you're learning like what someone's doing like you're learning the you're learning like oh someone's provoking me or oh this person is picking on me you know this person's trying to trigger me you know and so you, you're learning how to transmute it or to end something completely. You could be walking away from this situation. Yeah, you could be leaving this behind. There's, yeah, you could be walking completely away from this, like all together. Um, you could be leaving something completely behind and going towards your wish fulfillment. Yeah. I mean, it's almost like uh, someone pisses you off. And so with that anger or that energy, you manifest something that you want or manifest an outcome that you want to happen in your life. And it happens. <laughs> it's like, you know the fuck what? I don't want to deal with this no more. You know the fuck what? How about I just, I don't know, you manifest something else. Like, I don't want to deal with this or ever put up, put up with these type of energies ever in my life again. I don't want to ever run into these type of people ever again. I don't want to ever deal with this type of shit ever again. And so it never happens again. Like something drastically changes in your life to where the shift. It's like a shift. But it's like it took for that peak moment. There was power in your anger. There was power in your anger. You changed something. <laughs> Next 48 for the viewer. Ace of Cups. You got new love coming in. Fast, the chariot. Someone could be a cancer, or this could be a. Mm. If I had one wish, you would be my boo. Promise to love you. Um, someone like is wishing for you. <laughs> it's deep. It's real deep. Someone has a crush on you. Someone has a crush on you. Uh, they could be at a distance. This could be someone you don't know, or this could be someone you know, but they're coming towards you to confess their love, or this is what someone's thinking about doing. Shit, someone could have ended something, and they're coming towards you. Ten of Swords, Six of Cups. Uh, mm, six of Cups is someone from your past. It's someone you know. I didn't mean to say that. This is the Six of Swords. Ten of Swords, Six of Swords, Ace of Cups, Chariot. Someone has ended something. They're coming towards you to confess their love. <laughs> 